All right, Libra. Wow. First of all, we have the Empress here. Now, she is in the challenge position. This is our major arcana card. And the Empress, as we know, this is you also, um, Libra. This is the card of Libra. It can also be the card of Taurus, but it is in the challenge position. Now, this represents so many different things for me. I'm not going to get into all of them, but it's definitely three speaks to growth. It speaks to expansion. One of the messages that I'm getting or picking up is I feel as if all of a sudden something, there's a shift for some of you that changes and that by the end of the March, something that was completely stuck, almost like turns around. And I feel for some of you, it's gradual. And for some of you, it's just, it's really fast. Like almost, um, see, we're, we've got this energy of very much being, it's almost like not passable. Things aren't moving forward. They're very much up and down, up and down, choppy. And then there's a possibility for some of you where something comes in, an offer comes in, a person comes in, and then all of a sudden you're very, you're moving very quickly. And that's why the Knight of Swords is here. But for some of you, I feel like you get information or you hear news about a move. And this may be work related. This may not be you. It could be your spouse. It could definitely with the, with the armor here, this could be very much government or military related where instead of going this route, all of a sudden you're going this way and it's from being stuck to all of a sudden, bam, you're, you're moving or information is coming in regarding a situation. Now, this definitely can be uh, in love. It can also be in terms of like, I'm picking up home. So you may be having to rebuild. Uh, this could be your physical home, your mental home, emotional or spiritual home. But if you look at this, it's almost like, you may have to wait for someone to decide something. They are assessing a situation that is going to affect you. And for some of you, you are going to be the decision maker. And it's like, do I continue on this path? Do I continue in this job? Do I continue with this relationship? Or do I move on to something new? And for some of you, you're going to make the decision very quickly. And this also could be all of a sudden you get an invitation and you're traveling. So this may not just be a move. This could just be in terms of a trip that all of a sudden comes up. It could be that someone invites you. Uh, it could be your work tells you, you, you know, you're going to Spain. Uh, cause I feel like over, over water, I'm in the United States. So I'm being led, um, I'm being, I don't know, for some reason, I don't, I'm getting Spain for some of you, but it's going to be different for everybody. You're all over the world. So now I feel that possibly where things weren't moving all of a sudden, because they're moving so fast for some of you, be careful of moving too quickly on something because you might rush in so quickly that you're not really looking, you know, from being totally blocked to totally you're on the go. I mean, now, it's going to be different. Some people, this may be very important because I'm almost picking up as if this is like surgical or surgery and there's a need for, um, you know, something to act upon it quickly and not sit on it. 
So th- in, in that respect, then that's positive. I, I feel like some of you may even be waiting for the go ahead on building a house or something with land. I don't, I'm getting like soil or dirt. Now, this definitely could be planting seeds, uh, figuratively speaking, um, or literally speaking, I guess I could say too. Feel like in terms of a child is what I'm um, being led to say. And that where maybe there's been some difficulties regarding a child that something comes in very quickly. So that's one of the things that I am picking up. But, you know, with this card, I'm really focused to, um, this definitely could even be in an investment that things that you've been investing in, it could be a financial investment, could be in terms of a relationship, definitely a mental or emotional investment that has really kind of, it's almost like there's a need to take a step back and really decide what direction you want to go in. In terms of a business, there's an opportunity that is coming in and it comes in so fast that their timing is going to be very important. So just be aware. You might be like waiting for news to come in and all of a sudden it just, the news comes in very fast. And so timing, time is of the essence for some of you. Now, there also, I'm feeling with the Empress in the challenge position that growth has maybe been hindered in some way. I'm getting that it's almost like possibly a situation where it's two steps forward, one step back, two steps forward, one step back. And it's almost like you're feeling stuck. Because if you look at these energies, this is very much moving forward, and then all of a sudden you're going back, and then moving forward, and then you're going back again. And it's this repetitive cycle that maybe has gotten you so you're not very happy. So that's another message that I'm picking up. Now, with the, the number three... And there's possibly for some of you a choice to make. So this could definitely be an offer in terms of work. It could be a relocation. It could also be examining the finances or how much do I want to invest financially into a business opportunity? Do I want to go that direction? The past may definitely have some influence in whatever this is. Uh, whether relationship or learning from our past lessons or by moving forward, you, you have to look back. And some of you may have uh, been having a difficult time moving forward in some way. And it could also be with, with the Empress. And since we have the Empress and I have two knights here, and these, you know, in terms of male or female, I'm not really focusing on that so much, but there, the empress is the number three and we have three main people. We have the empress and two knights and there may be a decision in terms of love that some of you, uh, have to decide. Do I let go of the, the, the past or, or the person I've been with? And take a chance on start or starting something new. And you're reflecting on what to do. And so there is also very much that uh, somebody new comes in. But I, I don't know. When I look at the Knight of Swords, it's like it's, I don't know, somehow. I don't know if they remind you of somebody from your past. 
but I, I get this being pulled almost backwards. So with the, the, the three being in the challenge position, don't, uh, just jump into love for, you know, like look before you leap is the message that I'm getting. Because I feel like here there's a lot, things are moving really quickly and, oh, sorry, you can't even see that. So I wanted to show that to you. Things are moving very fast. Could even be news travels fast, but you know, where you were once very contemplative and, uh, and possibly even stuck, uh, then there's an offer of some kind. So I just, I, I just get the feeling, um, it's going to be different for some people, some of it. Time is of the essence. And for some of you, it could just be, be careful that there isn't something that is pulling you back or pulling you backwards, or there isn't someone that's pulling you back. There could be new love coming in. This could be a cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio. Does not have to be, but it could be somebody makes an offer, but you just, you, you can't go there. Like you're, you're not in a good place. Um, you're, you're being pulled back to somebody else or to past memories or remembrances or something like that. What direction are you going to grow the most? It's definitely about growth and, you know, um, un like unsticking yourself. And, and finding a balance because when I look at these cards together, it's like, we're very much stuck here. We're moving way too fast. And this is kind of like right in the middle of the three.